Hi everyone, about a minute from Tyler, Texas. I'm in Tyler today talking to the Energy Summit. Uh, it's an annual event put on by the Tyler Chamber of Commerce and it's good to be back here in East Texas. And I wanna talk about East Texas for about a minute because people forget about the importance of the East Texas field, which was discovered in 1930 right uh, near Tyler here. Uh, at the time it was discovered, and remember it was discovered on a wildcat well by a guy named Dad Joyner um, in 1930. After it was discovered, it became the biggest oil field in the world. It was it contained something like six billion barrels of oil. And this is an ancient history. It's less than 100 years ago. But the East Texas field was a critical part of the, the, the Allied victory in World War II. After the discovery of the East Texas field and during the war, uh, the U.S. built, rapidly built the Big Inch and Little Big Inch pipelines that carried crude from the East Texas field to the East Coast refineries. And that uh, fuel, that uh, oil then became a key part of the fueling the war effort in Europe and here in the U.S., of course. Uh, some 350 million barrels of oil flowed through the Big Inch and Little Big Inch pipelines from East Texas to the East Coast. And this was a critical part of American history. It was one of the reasons why the U.S. and the Allies won World War II. Um, it was a war, as uh, many analysts have said, it been, was fought uh, on oil. Um, and a lot of that oil came from this area. So we're inundated with these claims about the energy transition, oh, that we're going to go beyond oil and we don't need hydrocarbons. Well, the reality is East Texas Field still producing today. A lot of oil and gas companies uh, are still working here in East Texas. Texas. The East Texas field is a critical part of American history, and it's still a, a major, uh, not a big, not as big a producer as the Permian Basin, of course, in West Texas, but still a significant producer of oil today. Okay, I'll stop there. You know where to find me. I'm on Substack, robertbryce.substack.com. Thanks a lot. See you.